there. Welcome back to Aperture Gaming. Today I'm playing through Portal 2, Chapter 3. Um. Yes. No witty dialogue to start us off. I don't trust this. It's a trap. Why can't I jump up this? There is literally no height to it. Hey, hey, it's me. Go away. Well, I'm back. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? No, Wheatley did. He's just up there. Please take care of him. What happened, right? I was just lying there. Go away. Hmm. This plate must not be calibrated to someone of your generousness. Oh, come on. It hasn't even been a minute. Wait. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Try it now. Bird, right? Couldn't Go believe away. I... Wait, did he just say a bird? I've defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. Lower it. You won't. Ooh, no more Wheatley. I am free. Eh. Where am I? Uh? Look at you. I have become the big brain. I did that entire test in two seconds. Piloting a blimp. I'm out of here. Elevator. Elevator. To go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. Now, fears are real. They're cardboard cutouts. They're all the way up to the break room. And I'll tell you about the time I saw a deer again. You just did, you silly. <laughs> bouncy, bouncy. Oh, such a good time. Bouncy, bouncy. Well, you passed the test. I didn't see the deer today. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more tests of- You forget. I'm not human. Ha 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 ha. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun. Okay, I rub my cheek against it. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually do it. Oh. This is my camera. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Cool. What? What tea? Spoopy, wait, who drew this? But off is now but on. Excellent. You're a predator, and these tests are your prey. So is that Speaking camera? Of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Murderers. Did you guess sharks? Nope. Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. Nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel, B. Hey! Hey! Up here! I found some bird eggs up here! Wait, Doc oh, is back. I was enjoying myself for a minute. Bird! Oh, bird, bird! Kill it bird. now. Oh my. Ah. Uh. Okay. That's probably the bird in it. The Did you eggs. kill it? Livid! Okay, look, the point is, we're gonna break out of here, alright? Very soon, I promise, I promise. I just have to figure out how. 
to break us out of here. Here she comes. Keep te just keep testing. Remember, you never saw me. Never saw me. Wheatley was just here. I went and spoke with the door mainframe. Let's just say he won't be, well, living anymore. Anyway, back to testing. No, the birds. Right. Button time, yes. La boop. I got it now. Well done. Thanks. In fact, you did so well. I'm going to note this on your file. In the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. Really? Well, I was nice. This next test involves turrets. Turrets. You remember them, right? Ooh. They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh, wait. That's you in five seconds. Hi Good there. Luck. Oh my goodness. No, I didn't mean to push you over. I'm sorry. Oh, jeez. Ah. I'll put you up. See, normal. I was never here. Hi, Turriet. How, how, how? Meanie, that's it. No more nice Gladys. Please put me down. Nope. You're all gonna die now. Who's there? Target lost. I can practically hear the Doom music. All will suffer from my wrath. Run down. You're going to the Shadow Realm. Kaboom. I don't blame you. Get over here. And game. Come on, Cube. It's safe now. I'm afraid of heights. Why, Ag? I literally know how to do this in less than 10 seconds. You know how I'm going to live forever, but you're going to be dead in 60 years. Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Well, more of a belated birthday medical procedure. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. Shuri. Jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. That's not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people it looks fine. But right here a scientist has noted that on you it looks stupid. Well, what does a neck-bearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... Oh, wait. It's a she. Still, what does she know? Oh wait, it says she has a medical degree. In fashion. From France. I swear I can be so annoying sometimes. And what do I do here? I need help. Oh, 
Long G, I got it. Time for the killing. I'm going through the list of test subjects in cryogenic storage. I managed to find two with your last name. Really? A man and a woman. So that's interesting. It's a small world. After all... I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. You're safe. Goodbye. For now. Burn, baby, burn. I am the harbinger of death. That was beautiful. I am 10 billion IQ. Yes. I bet you think I forgot about your surprise. You did. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. After all these years, I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. Death time. Oh, that's the end. Now leave, there's nothing more.